This is what I call living. You can say that again, Biff. Your idea to rent this boat was a great one. Yeah, great boating, crummy fishing. I ain't had a bite in hours. You're just not using the right bait, Pugs. And now for the latest news update on the disappearance of the famous explorer, Chang Ling. It is feared Ling is lost on one of the many mysterious misty islands. Although the Coast Guard is searching the area, they have failed to turn up any sign of the missing explorer. What do you think, Biff? We've got this boat rented for the whole weekend. Which means we've got plenty of time to... Navigate our way to the misty islands and join in a search. There they are, gang. The Misty Islands. Ooh, ooh, there must be a couple dozen of them islands. How are we going to know which one Mr. Ling is on? Huh, Pugs? Huh, how? Yeah, shut up. What we need is our secret weapon, Fang, Fang Face. Face. Um, excuse me, I'll be back in just a minute. <laughs> okay, show him the picture of the moon. Here, Fangs, look! Face, use your super sniffer to sniff us a clue to which island Mr. Ling's on. Yeah, yeah. My nose is a nose that knows. I smell fabric of tint. An essence of burnt campfire wood. On that big island. Good work, Fang Face. Big Island, here we come. Listen to those noises. These Misty Islands should have been called the Scary Islands. Maybe that's what happened to Ling. He got scared and took off. Wait, what's that? Looks like a mess of footprints to me. Not footprints, Pugsy. Something more sinister than footprints. Ape prints. Ape prints? <laughs> Yeah, they're more sinister than footprints, pugs. Everyone knows that. Yeah, shut up. Come on, let's get the wolf buggy and follow those ape tracks. These ape prints are leading us deeper and deeper into this creepy jungle. <laughs> Hey, 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 what are we following? Apes or fish? Great. His super sniffer just got snuffed out. Now we'll never find those apes. <laughs> We don't have to find them. They found us. Let's get out of here. Hey, wait for me! Back to them! Those apes are gaining on us! Just then, they must not escape us. Quick, jump onto that log and let's paddle our way out of here. Yes, sir. You guys stick with my ideas and them apes will never get us. Yeah, yeah, pugs. You're always right, pugs. The apes won't get us. <laughs> but that alligator, he's going to get you. Yeah, that's ridiculous. No alligator's going to get me. <laughs> Quick, grab those vines. Swinging! <laughs> 
Them eight faces. Don't just stand there. Do something. Ooh, I'll leave it to me, pugs. I'll do something. See, see, pugs. I did it. I did something. Yeah, you sure did something. You got us trappedified. Willikers, the ape creatures have Pudsy and Fang Face. Yow! Now they got us. They are all our prisoners, Gorla. Take them to the city. <laughs> Now listen to me, you big gorilla. You can't keep us in here. We know our rights. Yeah! We know our rights. You tell them, pugs. Silence! If you have come to rescue the other intruder, you have failed. He will soon meet his fate, as will you. If you do not speak and tell us if there are other humans coming. But we don't know if anyone else is coming. We have methods to make humans talk, and we will use them to question these two first. Take them to the interrogation chamber. You first, furry creature. Talk. Don't say a singular word, Frank Face. Just tell him your only regret is that you got but one wolf life to give for your country. Yeah! <laughs> I only regret that I got but one wolf life to give. Talk, creature! Okay, okay. Now, if I had uh, two wolf life to give you, uh, maybe we could make a deal. <laughs> like, uh, one for you, and that would leave one left over for me. Enough! You will soon witness the fate of intruders who do not cooperate. Take them to the chamber of the traps. You think maybe I said the wrong thing, pugs? <laughs> Pugs, huh? You think maybe I should have said three wolf lives and offered him two? Huh, Pugs, huh? Eh, shut up. Come, they need no guards. There is no escape from our trap. We better think of a way out of this mess. Like but fast. Yeah, yeah, think, think, think. That axe is almost through the rope. Looks like we're goners. Oh, save us, pugs. I'll chew through the net and have us out in no time. Oops. Ooh, ooh, that fire pit looks just like the sun. Yay! Help, Pugs! Hey, what's happening? Of all the luck, when I need Fang Face, I get you. Ooh, we're doomed, Pugs! Doomed! 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 You ninny! Why are you chewing bubble gum at a time like this? Because I'm, I'm super scared. And when I'm super scared, I get super ideas, like how to save my super scared skin. Yeah, I forgot. That's the only time your brain works. Nice shot. You gummed it up. Now let's get out of here and rescue five Biff and Kim. Huh? How come they need rescuing, huh? Never mind, I'll explain later. Golly, Biff, how are we ever gonna get out of here? I don't know, but I'd sure like to know what's happening to Pugsy and Fangface. Ooh, ooh, this creepy place gives me the creepies. I'm nervous, I'm scared, I'm petrified. 
them. Eh, shut up and keep tiptoeing, meathead. Hey, we're in luck. It's the prison kitchen, which gives me an idea how to get Biff and Kim rescued. Now, here's the plan, Fangs. We disguise ourselves as ape people, take some of that food, and pretend we're saving dinner to the prisoners. You stand guard out here. Ooh, ooh. Maybe if I read Moon Man, my favorite comic book, I wouldn't be so nervous. I wonder why I never seem to finish this book. I only get as far as page one when a Moon Man sneaks to the moon. <laughs> Yeah, I figured you'd be too scared to stay alone. Okay, slice up them carrots, fangs. Carrots! Now, well, let's see. Uh, a couple of cucumbers, a bumbo, a couple of tomatoes, a couple of pickles. Oh, excuse me. Sure, pal. A couple of mushrooms, a couple of peas. A couple of carrots, and a couple of tints. A couple of beans, beans, beans. And a couple of onions. Onions? We ain't got no onions. That's what you think. Yikes! He's changed back to Fang Face, and every time he hears a food word, he tries to eat me. Yeah. Eat, 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 eat. Now I don't have to worry about you hearing any food words. And this is the only way to calm him down. <laughs> now to get into our disguises and rescue Biff and Kim. And this time, no food. <laughs> These ape disguises should work perfectly. Oh, yeah. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Dinner time for the prisoners. Boy, were those prisoners hungrified. Let's go! Take care of the guard! Good work, Fangsy! Now let's get out of here. We gotta find Mr. Ling. Strange. The streets are deserted. Listen, you hear them drums? I sure do. And they're coming from somewhere underground. Maybe that's where all the apes are. And maybe that's where they have Mr. Ling. Which means we gotta locatify them drums like but fast. Okay, Fangsy. Use your super ears to track down those drums. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> track, track, track. <laughs> He's on to something. <laughs> okay, Fang Face, what do you hear? <laughs> Drums. We know that. <laughs> well, I bet you didn't hear someone yelling, Help! <laughs> Willikers, if someone yelled, help, it's got to be Mr. Ling. We've got to find a way in. There could be a secret entrance. If there is, we'll never find it in a million years. <laughs> hey, Pugs, you won't have to wait a million years. I think you found the secret entrance. This creepy tunnel must be the right way. Those drums are getting louder. Willikers and double Willikers, look at that! Some kind of under... 
underground sacrificial chamber. And that man on the slab, that must be Mr. Ling. It's time to sacrifice the intruder. Soon he will belong forever to our ape idol. What are we gonna do, Biff? There's only one way to get up high enough to save Ling. And that room gives me an idea of the only way we can do it. We're gonna use those tapestries and bamboo poles to build a glider. Hurry! Mr. Ling is being pulled up to that idol's flaming mouth! Okay, it's up to you, Fang Face. Zoom off! Yeah, yeah! <coughs> Zoom! <coughs> Zoom! Zoom! <coughs> Seize the intruders! Esther, Fister! Here, yeah! And away we go! Strike them! Use the catapults! They're bombarding us with boulders! Yikers! That was close! Ah, ooh, ooh! That was closer! Mr. Ling is almost in the idol's mouth! Hold on, gang. We're going down. We got him! Hooray for Fang Face! He saved Mr. Ling! Yeah, yeah! Hooray for Fang Face! Hooray for... We gotta do something! Hold tight. We're going down after him. We did it! Pugsy saved Fangface! Yeah, we saved Fangface, but he brought along a couple of them ape faces. I did good, huh, Pug? I did good. You did dumb. Let go of them apes before they mess us up! Now let's get out of this joint. As Fangsy would say, that was what I call close, close, close. Yeah, them gorillas will never catch us now. <laughs> and now is when we head for our boat and then straight for home. Yeah! <laughs> home, home, home! <laughs> well... That wraps up another adventure. Thanks to you kids, I now have proof of the existence of those primitive ape creatures. Don't thank us kids, Mr. Ling. Thank Fangface, our favorite wolf. It was Fangface who saved you and us. Oh, shucks. <laughs> it was nothing. <laughs> You're right. It was nothing. Uh-uh. It was something. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> ooh. Huh? Hey, cut that out! What are you kissing me for, huh? What for, huh? Huh? Oops, sorry, Fangs. Uh, the sun came out and changed you back to, uh, I mean you. Yeah, well, never mind. Just never kiss me, never again. <laughs> How come I did the? Uh... Huh? How come I did that? How come? 